improving skin texture whether you have dry or oily skin. Egg yolk is rich in fatty acid which can moisturize the skin while the white contain albumin, a simple form of protein that help tighten pores and also remove excess oil from the skin. Egg is also great for getting rid of wrinkles and fine lines. Our next ingredient is banana and banana have a good amount of vitamin C which help your skin to look young and youthful. Banana help to get rid of the dullness from your skin. It also help to moisturize the skin. If you have dry skin, if you're looking to even your skin tone out, banana is going to do just that for you. Banana is also great for getting rid of spots and blemishes from the skin. Now for this recipe, I'm only going to be using the egg yolk. So the first thing I'm going to do, I'm going to separate the egg yolk from the egg white. So I'm just going to crack my egg open and it's pretty easy to separate the yolk. That's egg white. Getting all of it out. And here we have our egg yolk and this is what we're going to use with our banana. I'm going to put the egg white aside for another recipe. So next I'm going to prepare the banana and I'm going to use half of this medium banana. So I'm just going to cut a half and here it is and I'm going to peel. So here we have our banana peel and here we have our banana. Before we toss the banana peel we're going to scrape the inner part of the banana peel since this is loaded with a lot of nutrients and minerals that is great for getting rid of spots and blemishes from the skin. So we're going to use it all half. And now we could toss this and here is the banana peel. We're going to put this aside and this is our half of banana and now we're going to chop the banana and we're chopping this for easier blending. And this is our banana ready. So here are the ingredients. We have our egg yolk and we have our banana and banana peel and now we're going to put this together. We're going to use our entire egg yolk. So we're going to add our egg yolk to the blender. We're going to take our half a banana and banana peel and we're going to add this to the blender also. We're going to cover and we're going to blend. Do not add any liquid to this. We're going to blend this as is. And here is our banana and egg yolk and we're going to pour it in our bowl. So here we have our egg and banana facial mask but before we use this as a facial mask we're going to use this to make a facial scrub also. So we're going to take two tablespoons of brown sugar And we're going to take two tablespoons of our facial mask. We're going to mix this in the brown sugar. And here we have our facial scrub. So we're going to use this facial scrub to exfoliate our face just before we use our facial mask. So we have our egg banana brown sugar facial scrub and we have our egg banana facial mask. So now I'm going to show you how to use these two. A young, bright, radiant, 
wrinkle-free looking skin. Now here we have our two steps and I'm just gonna demonstrate for you. The first thing you're gonna do, you're gonna use your exfoliator to exfoliate the skin. To exfoliate the skin, you wanna wash your face if you're wearing any form of makeup get rid of all of that off your face and then you're gonna exfoliate the face so you're just gonna take a little on your hands and this is best done in the shower like this you're gonna rub it up and you're gonna feel the granules from the sugar and just rub it in your hands first and then you exfoliate your skin Now, if you have acne, this is good for your skin also. If you have dry skin, this is good. If you have large pores, this is gonna help to clean the pores. This is a wonderful treatment for the skin. And this is the, my exfoliation for the day, so I'm doing a good job here. Let me come up close. Just exfoliate. Now after exfoliating the skin, you're gonna rinse this off with some cold water. Now your skin is ready, your pores are clean, your grease are gone, the dead skin cells are all gone, and your skin is now ready to drink up the facial mask. Now, here is the facial mask, and you're gonna apply the facial mask on your face your neck, your décolleté area. Now you can use a brush to apply the facial mask or you can use your hands. Since I'm just demonstrating, I'm gonna use my hands to apply the mask. So I'll just put the mask in my hands like this. Wow, nice. And just be generous with it all over your face. Just apply the mask. You have wrinkles at the corner, don't forget, you could go as close, right under. I'm gonna go back for some more, I'm loving this. I'm so loving this. And there's no egg smell, you're smelling just banana right here. So be generous with this. Mm. Now for those of you who have wrinkled hands, don't waste the product, just use it on your hands. It's gonna do wonders for your hands also, okay? Once your face is completely covered with the facial mask, you're gonna have fun, you're gonna sit with it for about 30 minutes, 45 minutes to an hour. Let the facial mask penetrate the skin. Just sit with it. Do not be in any rush to get this off your skin. Just let it soak it up. Just enjoy it, okay? Now this is my skin after wearing my mask for about 30 minutes. And as you could see, take a look up here. It's like it's drying on the skin. It's not gonna be completely dry, but you're gonna get this drying effect on the skin. Now after about 30 minutes or so, you're gonna rinse this off with some warm water. When you rinse off, what is gonna happen is that you, first of all, while wearing this like I am feeling right now, I can feel my skin tightening. It's like a cool breeze, a very refreshing feeling.